Hey guys, welcome back to the channel. Uh, it's been a while since so we've done a Yu-Gi-Oh video, guys, and as you can see, we're on Dueling Nexus, so we're going to be showing off a little, little cool thing with some Cyber Dragons. You guys know Cyber Dragons are my favorite deck. I've featured them many, many times on the channel. But with Battle of Legends coming out next week, it turns out we are getting an indirect sport card that I didn't even know about in the duality. Uh, other people have, have mentioned this card, people have talked about it. I didn't even know what it was until maybe like three days ago. So for anybody that doesn't know what duality is, it's a quick play spell. You tribute one light or dark monster, especially when one light or dark monster from your hand or extra deck with the same original type and level but a different attribute. During your main phase, uh, you can banish this card from your graveyard, then target one light and one dark monster in your graveyard, shuffle them back in the deck, draw a card, you can both effects in the same time. Uh, so, in the case of Savage Dragons, with a Savage Dragon or a Galaxy Soldier, you can tag it out for a Chimera Tech Rampage Dragon. For a uh, Chimera Tech Fortress Dragon, you can tag it out for a Cyber Twin. Like, the card has some spice. Um, but, for us, it really helps unbrick certain hands. It gives us access to different combos. It actually turns a Galaxy Soldier or Cyber Dragon into a into a, a fetch for a core and then we can draw the extra card to make up the cards that we use like it's awesome we're playing a little uh, an OTK build slash synchro build with uh, our star synchron package you know Baron and Shin Shin uh, I'm really excited to show you guys this alright we won the rocket position we're choosing to go first but this is primarily going second version of the deck hence the three Jizakiru's the three Forbidden Droplets. Like, I want to be able to break my opponent's board, but I also want to be able to play Gunk first. So let's see if we can show off a little a little something something. So we're gonna activate Cyber Emergency, do our usual, grab core. Now I'm gonna summon core. I'm gonna grab a repair plant. Now normally, you know, you go use a repair plant. Uh I fucked up. Fucked up a little bit, but we'll see. So normally, you know, you'd use your pair line grab gods, but we're gonna do something a little different. So we got, we've got our sizes. We gotta link away. Core for Almirage. Turn on all our cards. And go right up. Go look for Cyber Dragon, specifically Cyber Dragon. Now, obviously, there's in a lot of decks you could, you know, go Gas Soldier with the hurts you have in hand. You could also end with um, like Ramana and stuff, but I feel like this is better. But now, using our Cyber Repair Plan, we can actually grab Star Synchro. And then Synchron's effect, which is hand or graveyard, we tribute a monster, special summon it. And now, start a synchro effects. We search a starter spell or trap card. In this case, we're searching the other card of our little package, Star Illumination. This is the reason we're actually playing two synchro, otherwise, we play one synchro. But in order for Star Illumination to work, you have to be able to send a synchro monster to the graveyard. We send the other starter synchro, which is not a dead card, because you can actually make Shin Shin later. But right now, if we're going first, we're going to make Baron. In game, like if we were going to get two, we know there would be two vanishes. We could make we could make Shinshin turn one. But by banishing illumination, we can actually raise the level of this monster by one. Bam. And then we're gonna make Baron de Fleur. And then we gonna set one. And we're gonna proceed to end things. So we have three interruptions. We do have a Jizakiro to get uh to help break both the board on the next turn. And we have a Hertz to give us a follow-up. Because we can get back our core or some other kind of place if we need to. Alright, what do we got here? Drop tricks. Mmm. Do we need this? Yes. We're gonna do it with them. So just keep our two army gates. We're using Imperm A to lock down that column, you know, so you get the actual play the spell shop on and stops it. We're also doing it to keep our army gates. Now what I do not know what this lab card does, so we're just gonna let it go. Hopefully it doesn't screw me. Uh 
Uh, sorry that's a little, I'm a little dark now. I have to shut off the, uh, my ring light for whatever reason. It's like flashing. Uh, this is really good. One, two. That's it. And we just keep like we just keep like a block. Okay. Uh, we're not gonna use banners of effects. See, we can we have our other stars in our grave, which I think we can actually use and uh we can have a monster on board. But instead we're gonna go like this. We're just going to Soldiering. Monsters are banished as well as possible. We're not using it. That's fine. And then we're going to activate Baron and pop the other card. Damn. Ooh, that's a good hit. That's a real good hit. And I put my left. Wah, wah, wah. All right, that's game one. We didn't get to show off duality, but I did want to show off the start of Synchro Online because uh, I've seen a few people in like Cyber Dragon groups that are wondering how the start of Line works, uh, the start of Synchro Online works, and that's the kind of potential that it gives us. We still had three cards that we could have played with, and having two Omni Negates is just fire. So I'll be right back with my next one. All right. This hand's awesome for what we're trying to do. This time we are going second, and we opened up duality with two machine dupes, which is crazy. So as long as he doesn't kill our core, we are in the money. And we also got Star Synchron already in hand, so well, with our hand, Baron's already alive. We're gonna try to extend as much as we can and potentially put our point to sleep for this turn. Lady of Lament, oh, it's a trap, it was a trap card deck. He can trim you, he, his effect is he can trim you our stuff, right? What the hell is that? Is that chain material? Hard desires. I'm very confused with what kind of deck this is. Dark World Dealings. Ooh. We're gonna discard Synchron. Because Synchron's alive in the grave. So it's like we didn't lose anything. As a matter of fact, he just gave us a Cyber Dark Chimera. And a second duality, holy shit. All right, so we're gonna start off with Cyber Dragon Core. Now, see, the way this is, we don't care if we get hands up. Metaverse. Oh, right, 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 they banned. They banned, uh, field spell, thinking of, I don't know, I'm having a brain fart. Uh, where am I gonna go with? We have everything we kind of need. We're gonna go Cyber Lord Fusion. Just in case we need a quick fusion or something. Alright, so. Machine Duke it up. Let's see what happens with the Machine Duke. Ma Mystic Mind. That's what it was. They, they banned Mystic Mind. They Christ. Alright, so. Bung. Bung. Alright. Now, what's in our grave again? Alright. We are going to. Nymph and Tiara. Hmm. You know what? Yeah. We'll save the second machine. I was going to use the second machine to get another Cyber Dragon, but instead, we're going to save it so that way we can. Never mind. Uh, I'm bad. <laughs> I was going to say, so we have it for Chimera, but we can't even use Chimera, so yeah, I'm bad. Alright, we're going to Nova. I should just use the other machine dupe to have another body on board. Alright. Bam. Now we got infinity. Now we have a gate. Now I'm, I feel very, very safe. So we're not going we're going to actually use duality right here. Get rid of, get rid of Cyber Dragon. The guy's potential OTK. Rampage. Activate Rampage. 
Actually, this super gives us ODK. Hold up. Because look, now we can dump Jizakiru that we don't need. Actually, we're going to dump Hertz and Nexter. Bung bung. Hertz goes off, gives us Nexter. You guys can probably see what I'm doing now. Grab back Nexter. So this is already 8,000 damage on board, but we also still have two phase down, so I want to make sure I can put my opponent to sleep. Um, so we're gonna go activate, discard. Now normally I would not do this. This is just me trying to extend, because by using Nexter's effect, we're gonna lock ourselves out of Baron. So we can summon and start a Synchron, but we won't be able to get Baron. So we we're losing all on and on But we're definitely trying to go for the kill right here. So now we're gonna use Nexter's effect, bring back Chimera since it has 21 defense. And then we're gonna use Chimera's effect to discard the other machine dupe that I saved. So maybe I, so maybe I, I did this entirely on purpose, who knows? We're gonna grab that power bond. Then we're gonna make another link monster. One and two. Like this is already a super overkill. But I just wanna see how far we can go. I do play a second rampage, mostly because of Nova's effect and now because of duality. So we can definitely pop that back row. So we're going to fuse together our Hertz and our OG Cyber Dragon for this. And then we're going to activate effects to pop these two. Nice. And then because uh, rampage is not once per turn, we're going to send another two machine monsters. We'll send the two Jizakiru's. We don't need those, and then we will proceed to battle phase. Um, we're just gonna smack, we're gonna activate this because you know I like big damage. So that was just an example of what I could have done. What also, what I also could have done is I could have played the second machine loop to get our third cyber dragon. And that would have had duality live even when I was going for Nova. So let's say they had destroyed one of my, uh, they had gone to just kill my my Cyber Dragons. I could have got into Rampage, been able to dump, been able to get more cards from the drop. For example, like I did with Naxter, and been able to keep on playing. I also could have used the Rampage that I got to link or to overlay, got out into the grave, and then got to draw cards off of the duality and grave. It's a really, really fun card. But we're gonna find one more opponent. And then we'll call the video. Yeah, Alright. This hand is mid. This hand, no, this hand's bad. This hand's really bad. Well, we can. If Godzilla doesn't get negated, this hand's okay. But if it does, it's dead. But duality actually makes this hand kind of playable. Transmodify. Melodious? I don't know, squad about Melodious, so what are you gonna watch this guy play? <laughs> We do have just a care if we're going second. Oh, that's all he did? If this card was special summon all three, I'm on the table. That's it. I mean, I. Is he gonna get it? Yep, there's the Ash. I am okay with that because we're about to beat the brakes off of you. Duality. Go bang. Now we use Rampage's effects to dump hearts and core. Do you want to activate the effect of hearts? Yes. Get back the core. Double check our grave. Looking good. Summon the core. Core's effects. Mm -hmm. Um. Okay, fine. Then we're gonna activate repair plan. We already have a cyber dragon in grave. We're gonna get back our other god soldier that he didn't want us to get. <laughs> we also could have got cyber dragon if we have those. But now we're gonna dump the Zakiro so we don't need that anymore. Now I could link into Seeger and just swing, but I wanna push this a little bit farther. So you know. He has two cards in hand, one monster on board. So we're just gonna do this. Oop. 
into our Stardust play. Points are rendered. We still had uh, another way to get a monster, so 700 plus 62, that's 69. I think we had game. If not, he would have had to get over Baron, which not a lot of people could do, especially with two cards in hand. Uh, but as you can see, we got Ash, and we still able to make a play out of the hand. I could have went another direction. I could have went into Infinity, and I think I still could have been able to make Baron. I think, depending on if I had changed up my searches a little bit. But... Like I said, this is just a little bit of what duality can do. I'm sure there's a million other ways that somebody could flex with that card. I just discovered now that you can actually turn Rampage Dragon, uh, not Rampage Dragon, Chimera Tech Fortress Dragon into Cyber Twin and Chimera Tech uh, Mega Fleet into Eternity. And since you tributed a, a fusion, it actually becomes untargetable and destroyable. So that's just another more spice that we now have access to. So let me know what you guys think down in the comments. Let me know what you guys have done with this card. Let me know what you guys think of this card as a whole. I think it's going to be a three out of my deck. Uh, it's going crazy. And we need as much flexibility as we can get. If you guys want to check me out on social media, there's also awesome down below. Again, I'm going to try to get more Yu Gi Oh! videos out. But that's it for me. I'll catch you guys on the next video. Later.